So we're going to work on the Klemheis and the English Presick. So what normally people would do, well this is a tiny little branch, but um, you do the Alpine Butterfly and you'll capture it on along in your, or in your rope and you'll run it up to the top of the tree and then you would say if you're going to footlock you have a loop like this and um, there's a couple ways to tie it. I like to tie it from the top to the bottom so I'll start at the top and I do the three wraps down one, two, three and then what I'll do is I'll capture the bite that's on top up through here okay there you got to tie a dress and set it so this Clem heist is a knot that only goes upward so you would connect this to your, your saddle with a carabiner and every time you would do a foot locking step you would push this up. When you put weight on it, it would capture and it would, it would hold you. So there's another way to tie it. You can tie it by going upward. Okay, so to do that, same thing. You start by making your wraps and you just go upward. One, two, three. And then you get the bottom, put it through that bite, bring it through. This isn't like one of the, it's not really a proper cord, but if you had a proper cord, you'd probably do better. Anyhow, that's kind of what it looks like when you're done. So that's the front of it and then the back of it. Now the next one we'll work on is an English Prissick. So with the English Prissick, what you do is you grab your rope and just go around three times. One, two, three. So what that does, this, this bite right here holds them all together and it locks, it locks. So an English pressic is a knot that can go upward and downward, but in, the, in this, in using it in this way, it's really just to go up the tree. And when you get to the top, you would um, change out to your climbing system. Um, you would connect just like the other one, connect it to a carabiner and to your belt. So that's what the English Pressic looks like. Okie doke. Want to give it a try, Noah? Yeah. Okay, cool. Go three times downward. Yeah, and then kind of like, like dress it so they're all like touching the rope. You know, like twist them so they're touching the rope. Yeah, it's all smooth. Now pull down on the the black part. Just pull down on the, and pull it, pull it. Don't, yeah. There you go. Cool. So that's it, the clump heist. So uh, let's see if you can do the English pressic. Pull it all the way through snug. Yep, there you go. There. Make it snug. 
bring it around and just do a little opening get the end of it pull it through pull it through and just make it snug all the way tight just make it super tight that way you can get it back in order yeah, and situate those. There you go. Are they all in line? There you go. Cool. Now do one more and then open it up when you get around. Oh, Pull it tight. Okay. Now pull it down. Pull that piece down. Pull it hard. There you go. Got it. There you go. Ta-da! All right. So uh, we just worked on the Klemheis and the English Pressic foot locking knots. Um, you use it with a foot locking loop. Um, so the next thing we're going to work on will be the um, cow hitch. Uh, with two halves and a timber hitch. Those are good uh, knots for using as a sling. All right, take care. <music>